People want subways, folks. Subways, subways. They don't want these damn streetcars blocking up our city. That's what they don't want. First, there was the mayor's angry rant to council before his stunning defeat on the Shepherd Light Rail vote. Then Rob Ford emerged with this shocking proclamation. This is an election issue. I guess uh, obviously the campaign starts now, and uh, I'm willing to take anyone on to fight him uh, uh, streetcars against subways in the next election. The next election is more than two and a half years away, yet the mayor seems intent on keeping the subway fight alive, perhaps using it as an issue to campaign on in 2014. I was disappointed at that. I was hoping that yesterday would be the uh, the uh, end of a long and difficult uh, process. The mayor's allies seem bothered by the vow to start campaigning now. 12 o'clock to 1 o'clock. The very campaign that saw Rob Ford elected as mayor lasted nearly one year. Now, a year and a half into his first term, there's a belief the temptation to campaign again will distract him from his job as mayor. Take it from this one-time candidate for the job. It's way too early for that. It's way too early for the mayor to say that. They should get back to focusing on building a better city, and there's lots to be done there. Yet surprising as it may seem, Rob Ford isn't the only one thinking about the next race for mayor. I've been approached by, by people who care. Councillor Adam Vaughn says he's already heard from political kingmakers who are looking for a candidate to put up against Ford. When serious people with, with, uh, with the, the city's best interests at heart and with a history of, of, of getting mayors elected are asking you to think about it, I think you deserve, uh, they deserve an, an honest answer. Vaughn's answer to date, no thank you. The councillor says he's more concerned about the issues at hand a sentiment echoed by those who aren't even thinking about the next election. Don't worry about campaigning. If you're doing a good job in this four years, you'll get back in. If you're not doing a good job, you won't. Jackson Prosco, Global News.